In this fourth video, we add corner links representing turnbuckles or similar to the same model we used in the third video. The program will automatically assign the same material properties to all cables, guys, links and backstays based on the default materials set in the materials database. We can see this on the check model tab with the plot of cables and links. We can see they're all cyan, which indicates the program has automatically calculated initial tensions for all elements. In more complex models, FEA may not be able to isolate each of the elements and estimate their initial tensions. We can override the assigned materials individually, but a more efficient method is colouring the elements and then assigning material properties based on these colours. In this second version of the model, we colour the backstays red and the corner guy links are coloured yellow. The program will assign these coloured links to C lists in accordance with AutoCAD colour order. Red will be C list 1 and yellow will be C list 2. We select the whole model, then make model, but this time we don't keep the materials and allow FEA to create a new materials list. Now on the materials tab we see the same four poles as compressible members, but at the bottom of the list we now see C list 1 and C list 2. We can assign different properties by clicking on the material, then from the material library select Use Cable from Database, select a different cable, I'll use 8mm, and once confirmed this will change the material and also increase the initial tension in the cables. We repeat this for the corner links and note that the material settings at the bottom of the list will override the materials assigned earlier in the list. We can change the initial pre-stress tensions by changing the auto calc settings for both C lists to refine. We then solve for low case zero. We then come back to the pre-stress tab and click on the Refine Initial Tensions from Low Case Zero results. This will reduce the initial tensions based on the results from the Low Case Zero analysis. When we solve the model, the solver requires less iterations to find a solution than the previous model reflecting the increased stiffness we added to the backstay cables with the corresponding increase in the reaction values.